Um, the second bank raid that we had here, uh, we were confronted by two men, one with a sawn off shotgun. And uh, as soon as I pressed the alarm system, the smoke, the smoke cloak system fired, and it was excellent. Um, the gunmen didn't have time to to do anything really. They they left the branch, and I felt quite happy, um, quite secure behind the counter because of the smoke system. And I can't praise it highly enough. This is a normal counter area uh, in one of our stores which you would normally expect the uh, burglars to attack. But as you can see, the ceiling mounted smoke cloak is aimed to protect this area. And always remember, you can't steal what you can't see. This is an example of Smoke Cloak instant protection stopping loss. TTL Group had a Smoke Cloak fitted recently after a series of break-ins. On Sunday the 13th of April the thieves returned for another go. They made a determined effort to break through the steel security door at the rear of the premises and after five minutes or so of crowbars and throwing themselves at it, they succeeded. Crossing the inner lobby, they triggered the alarm approximately 10 seconds prior to smashing the hinges off the door between the inner lobby and the loading bay, which was protected by smoke cloak. They just had time to enter the loading bay before being engulfed in the smoke. 13 seconds later, about 23 seconds after triggering the alarm, they were running for their lives. No stock was lost.
approximately two months ago. A demonstration was held at one of BP's larger franchisees. After the demonstration, he decided that this product from Smoke Cloak would be the solution to a lot of the problems that he had within some of the stores through burglary. Approximately a month ago, an SY4000 was installed into one of his stores in Melbourne. On June the 18th, 2005, thieves broke into the store and attempted to steal the product which they were after, in this case was cigarettes. As you can see, the unit discharged as soon as the glass door was broken. By the time they had reached the counter, this was, this was engulfed with the smoke. One of the thieves attempted, with, a large, with that same large sledgehammer, to break in the manager's door where he believed more goods were being stored. As you can see, his attempts were futile. After having two goes at it, he decided enough was enough. He's jumped the counter. His offsider, in partner in crime, followed suit. They both left the building the same way they entered, empty-handed. No stock was lost. Police files unlocked tonight. The amazing anti-theft device that smokes out would-be robbers. You're about to see two bank robbers get one hell of a shot. Suddenly, they can't see a thing. They may as well be wearing blindfolds. So, they're out of there. And that's exactly the reaction the bank wanted. What you're watching is called a smoke cloak. And it's just been triggered by the bank teller. It's so thick the bad guys can't see anything or do anything. The smoke is harmful, but it can fill a large room in just 30 seconds. This great anti-theft device was designed in the UK, but now it's come to Australia. Just check out this bottle shop in Melbourne. That smoke cloak's just been triggered by a remote sensor. See how the smoke machine's installed near the counter? When it goes off, the smoke forces the bad guys away from the money or the people, so they can't rob the till or threaten shop assistants and tellers. Instead, the thieves are driven straight out the door where they belong. Police files unlocked. 